Good morning. I hope you're doing great. It's another super hot day here on the East Coast and I am heading out to the pool again. We're doing swimming lessons for a little while, but <laughs> I have to show you something and give you my first impressions of something that I purchased and I really don't need. However, I think I'm going to love it. And that is the Urban Decay Smoked Palette. I'm sure you've seen this. This is I'm not the first person who's purchased this. I did buy it, by the way. A lot of people on here have said that they received it. I did not receive it without paying for it. Um, it looks like this. It's got a Perversion Eye Pencil, which is the blackest black that um, Urban Decay makes. I used it today. And then it's got on the top a line of what I would call neutral shadows. These are fairly neutral down here as well. And then a jewel toned blue green and a nice dark gray um i've already got this shadow here i i wore it in a few um a few videos but one a couple ago that people were asking what i was wearing it was actually mushroom i love this color from urban decay but you could basically buy two single urban decay shadows is it two two and a half Urban Decay shadows and, and you could have bought this whole palette with a full size pencil. This is a very good value if you look at it like that. I like this better than their new palette where you can pop in the colors like a MAC palette sort of. Um, yeah, the packaging is interesting. It's got a zipper. At first I go, oh that's really stupid. But I got it. It's a nice zipper. It's easy to use probably good for travel. It does fold over. See, there's nice good size mirror here. So that's good. You know, you can do your makeup with this mirror. This mirror would be perfectly acceptable if you were in a hotel room and didn't like the lighting in the restroom or whatever and you went over by the window. This is a very good size mirror. You could definitely do your makeup with that, which I really appreciate. Not everything has a good mirror. So that's good. Then the pencil is really, really touted. People love this. I'm a much bigger fan of the MAC Eye Cole and the Stila Cajal, which I talk about all the time. I'm sure you're sick of hearing about it. I did use this today. I have one. I bought it when it first was released thinking, ooh, what if this is the best pencil ever made? I have to have it. I haven't used this particular one yet, but I use the one I already have. Let me show you what I do with my eye makeup, and, um, and uh, I'll, I'll just tell you what colors I use first. I used Freestyle, that would be this peachy nude on the lid. I used Mushroom in the Crease. Um, back Door, I used underneath the uh, lower lash line. And I used Bar Lust in the outer V. Um, I used Kinky in the inner corner and as the brow bone highlight. So, this is what it looks like. This is the finished product. If you will. And I use the Perversion Pencil in the waterline. I don't feel personally that that is the best waterline pencil. I always do that to you guys. Zoom in on my pores. Thank you. Yes, I'm obviously inept with the camera. Um, but this palette is really, really good. I could seriously keep this palette if I were going on a very long trip, or if I were going on a trip where makeup was not available for purchase, which, the horrors, but okay. So like, say you're on a cruise, which I have done. There's not like a place where you can go buy whatever, makeup or whatever. So I would use this. This is great. You can do a nice neutral eye. There are one, two, three, four matte colors. You can do something really exciting with these colors. You could do a nice Arabic eye with this. I love this color. It's called Rockstar. It's kind of purpley. You can, you know, do a smoked navy eye, a green smoky eye. But I, I'm loving it. The neutrals are awesome. These are good size pans, and the packaging is pretty darn good, even though the zipper is a little weird. But Weird, but I like it. So let me just put that out there. It also comes with a, a primer potion in this size. This is pretty, 
pretty good size, actually. I don't know if it's half the size of what they usually are or what, but this will last a good... If you use it every day, this would probably last you a good three months. So that's... This is very good. And then it came with this book, which is kind of cool. It's got... Essentially... It tells you how to do different looks. Would I, you know, would I personally use this? I might, I might. I might just try it out and see if I like what they say to do. They had something I've never seen before, um, the way they did it. Let's see, where is it? I'm kind of liking this, the smoky cat eye. I might have to try that. I, I, even though I do makeup for other people and enjoy makeup a great deal, I somehow suck at a cat eye. I cannot ever get it even. I've tried. I, I can do it on other people. I cannot do it on myself. Whenever I try, it looks stupid. So maybe I'll take their their instructions and try it out. But anyway, my overall impression is love. I really, really love this. If I were going to, if I were in the market for one palette and it could be an Urban Decay palette only, this or I was going to say the Naked 2 palette, but you know what the funny thing is? I don't use it that much and I do think I'm going to use this a lot. The Naked One palette is beautiful. If you like warm tones, I tend to gravitate toward the more cool neutrals. But I do use the Naked palette a lot on other people. Um, if you have brown or blue eyes, the Naked palette is incredible. If you have green eyes, I think it is probably better for you to get the Naked Two palette. And this is kind of good for everyone and the instructions are really awesome i like this as a gift for a younger person also like if you have a teenager in your life or something like that i really am loving this this is really really cool for that um so anyway and now <laughs> no buy must commence for a while i think i'm gonna no buy for perhaps the rest of the summer, because it is time to purchase curriculum for my children, and that gets kind of spendy. So I, th I think I'm on a no-buy. I know that really hurts. Ugh, ugh. Okay, I'm on a, my, I'm on a, I am on a fixed income for the rest of the summer. I think I will try to limit myself to 50 bucks a month on makeup. That's gonna be hard. Help me out, girls. Help me out. And guys, um, Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. You guys are awesome. I don't take it for granted at all that each and every one of you um, clicked subscribe and I really, really appreciate it. It is so cool to have you to talk to and hopefully help out. If you have anything else you'd like a review on, let me know. Um, or if there's a tutorial you're interested in. Have a great day and stay cool. Take care. Bye-bye.